Hello, and welcome to the latest episode of Through the Pages, the first one of the year, and starting off with a great book, Bad Monkey by Carl Hayeson. So this came out in 2013. Um, I had never read anything by him. I was at the bookstore and that's just got lit on fire for some recommendations and we kind of putted around the store for a little bit trying to find things and then after a while like a light went off. She's like, Carl Hayes said, like, if you love Tom Robbins who like you can see a little glimmer of like his books here, um, she's like, you'll, you'll love this, knowing I also like mysteries. So this was a wonderful fusion of like mystery and just really funny writing. Um, the dialogue was hysterical, kind of what was happening in the stories, everything. And so um, like midway through, I looked up the book as like, has this ever been a movie? This feels like it could be a movie. And saw that one of the producers of Ted Lasso is turning it into a series with Vince Vaughn as the lead. So I'm very, very excited for that. Um, I think it's going to HBO. Um, but the book was just a like I didn't want it to end it was it was so good I already bought another one of his um squeeze me so review on that coming at some time near future but yeah what I liked about it is that like the the mystery element was really solid which I think sometimes can be like the throwaway part when there's comedy involved and so this it held up really well but unlike other mysteries where like as you start to get a sense of like the the parts that were unknown when you start to know them, it doesn't feel like the book went downhill. Like <clears throat> it kept tying things up and bringing things together in a way where it, did, it didn't feel like, like once you hear the punchline of a joke, doesn't need to be more words and sort of a, in a sense where some of like whodunit type things or like, like mysteries where once you know, then it's like complete, you know, I'm, I'm, I, I don't need any more. And so like, I've mentioned in reviews before of like wanting to kind of push that understanding to the very end where this one was the opposite, but it had so much sort of a backswing to it that, um, or follow through that really, really was great. And I think once I started to imagine Vince Vaughn as the main character, the detective Yancey, um, and this story, as always, no, no spoilers here, is basically just like a, a detective who had gotten demoted to restaurant inspector. And it's all in the Keys around the South Florida, just very crooked area. Um, and it, it, it was very good, <laughs> yeah. Um, but wonderful route, it was very good. Uh, very, very articulate way to say it. Um, but yeah, imagining him reading the dialogue, I, I almost just like processed it like one and a quarter times as fast. Like it, it he, his wit is so good, and so like this, um, there were so many lines in it that were just hysterical. So it's a book that, from beginning to end, is just, just top notch. I will say I read it. Maybe I was like beginning of the year, and I've been a little slow on doing this video, but I've I've been eager to do it and eager to read more of his stuff. So if you have read others from Carl Hayeson, what? What books should I read of his? Um, I told you I got it, I think his most recent, squeeze me, but this this came out in 2013, and this man has published a lot of books. You can see those are all uh, the books, and that is just when this was published. So, I even had kids' books in there, which surprises me a lot from the dialogue, I will say. Um, yeah, it's funny and a little 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 crude for some folks out there, I can run into my sister, and I, I was a little like, ooh. I don't know if that if be her, her style, but yeah, she seemed to be liking it. Um, I think my dad's going to read it. Yeah, really, really good stuff. Like the cover. There was just a lot of a lot of characters in it where it didn't feel like so fixated on the detective or even the, like the perp. And so it was able to kind of bounce around and create this kind of kaleidoscope of Southern Florida insanity. And yeah, it, it was just so well done where... It, I don't know how you write that many like plots at once and not to say that it's like you know all over the place but like there's just so many levels to it and for being such like a easy to enjoy comedy book too like yeah it, it's simple yet complex um yeah really really good book um Highly recommend. I wouldn't be surprised if this is in my top 10 novels I read all year, and it's early in the year. So, 
if you like that video, if you want to see more videos, books along this lines, um, mystery books, maybe some gut health books in there, the weird type of things I read, hit the little subscribe, hit a little like if you watch this and enjoyed it. Uh, hope you have a nice day.